I'm going to be selfish right now. My birthday's on Monday. <laughs> Happy early birthday! So we always like celebrate our things together. So, you oh, know, because she great. gave birth to me on Mother's Day. So it's oh. like her celebration too. That's so special. You know? So we do a big old party all together. I love it. <laughs> All right, guys, it's 4.51 in the morning. We're off to a nice start here on our maps. We see a little bit of traffic building up on the 17th southbound here as you get closer to 7th Avenue, but that's because that's construction's going on in that area, so that's why you start to see a little bit of slowdown. Let's check in with the Maricopa area on the 347. We have green in both directions. Same thing with the 10 here. If you're heading to Tucson, you're off to a great start this morning. Just a reminder about these ramp closures on the I-17. The I-17 southbound on-ramp at Thunderbird is closed, and then the I-17 southbound off-ramp is closed at Cactus and then the I-17 frontage roads are closed in that area altogether. They're doing some construction now until late fall. So remember that when you're heading out over there. But let's plan ahead. Let's look at our, look at our future cast for 7.30 a.m. And we'll see some traffic in the North Valley on the Loop 101 heading east as you approach the I-17 and it continues into the 51. And then the 17 heading south as you get closer to the Glendale area. You're going to hit some orange there where it's moving about 35 miles per hour. And of course, we'll see our typical slowdown on the I-10 eastbound as you approach 59th Avenue and it continues continues towards downtown Phoenix. So that's what you can plan for for 7.30 a.m. I'll keep you updated if any accidents pop up this morning. Rachel? Thank you much. We'll still head on today in AZ.